In this video, I'm going to give you a quick overview of what iRise is and take you on a tour of the platform. Traditional requirements tools help you document and manage requirements, but they do little to ensure you're actually gathering the right requirements in the first place. That's where iRise is different. iRise is the only platform that allows you to validate your requirements by combining them with interactive diagrams and prototyping. You will still capture text requirements, but they'll be created in the context of the functionality that they describe using the prototype. This makes them easier for you to document and much easier for your stakeholders to understand and validate them. And at the same time, you'll manage the requirements throughout the entire process using tools directly in iRise and by integrating with other ALM tools like Jira, Rally, and TFS. This unifies the entire software development lifecycle from end to end. Now product managers, business analysts, and user experience designers will use prototyping and real-time collaboration to drive the conversation around requirements, to ensure they get the requirements right and that nothing falls through the cracks. Let's take a look at how it works. First, let's click into a project and talk prototyping. When it comes to creating prototypes, iRise was designed with a non-technical user in mind. The drag and drop interface allows business analysts and everyone else to quickly assemble wireframes, mockups, and prototypes. As you get started, you can choose from a variety of templates, and they're broken down by page and device type. You'll also have widget libraries to pull from, and these libraries are customizable and they're global, so they're available to the entire team. Share design patterns and common screen layouts, media, icons, branded UI elements, and interactive widgets. And they're a great way not only to speed the process, but also to enforce branding standards. And if you've got other assets that you've already created, it's easy to bring those into iRise too. Just drag your sketches and screens into your project, and it will automatically create project pages for you, even selecting the right page type if they're sized correctly. And from there, you can create lo-fi wireframes to help sketch out process flow, or hotspot-driven mockups, or hi-fi prototypes that include data and logic, which will mirror the final application you intend to build. Adding interaction is easy too. Using the Actions panel, you can combine triggers like click, mouse, and swipe events with actions like linking, showing and hiding, and data manipulation. Add effects into the mix, and you've got a basis for incredibly realistic prototypes that allow you to convey to the user how you intend the final app to behave. You can simulate your mobile prototypes using the browser-based emulators or running them directly on your iOS mobile device using the free iRise mobile app. When you're ready to preview and test, you hit the play button and the functionality you've created comes to life. Which brings us to the reason why you're creating these prototypes so that you can share them with your stakeholders, gather accurate requirements, and validate them. And the magic of iRise is that you're creating these requirements and user stories in the context of the functionality that they describe. You can tie a requirement directly to a widget for clarity. You can start a threaded discussion on the requirement itself. And you have detail fields, so you can capture things like type, status, and priority. And you can customize these detail fields to match the way your team works. And once your requirements are ready for feedback, you can click the Share with Others link. And you can choose to share with groups of users or individuals. And you can add them as either reviewers or editors. They'll receive an email notification that includes a link to the project. And then they can review and add comments and you'll see their feedback in real time. And you can then make changes on the fly based on it, which they'll see in real time. And you can iterate from there until you get it right. When you need to document specific interactions, you can create interactive user flows, process diagrams, and use cases. These can be as dynamic as your prototypes, and you can annotate these as well. 
As an example, you could link an object in a diagram to see related screen, flow, or functionality. By bringing your diagrams to life, stakeholders are going to better follow the story that you're trying to tell. Through collaborative prototyping, you can be confident that you've captured the right requirements. Now let's take a look at how you manage and track those requirements in Iris. Click Manage to see a consolidated view of all project requirements, user stories, tasks, and other related deliverables. Drag and drop to organize, filter, and prioritize them. You can configure and customize each project to fit the way your team works. Maybe you want to capture detailed specifications, or perhaps you prefer user stories and epics. The data you capture is up to you. Add story points, sprint assignments, or due dates. Assign owners, priority, and status. Organize all your project documentation, from the project charter and high-level business requirements, to user research and personas. You can document and manage your backlog of user stories as well. Just drag and drop them to prioritize. When you drag a card from one column or row to another, its properties are automatically updated to match. You can customize the columns to track status, assign sprints, or assess priorities. When you have a question or need clarification, you can add a comment, which will send an email notification to all subscribers. You can even create a Scrum or Kanban view when development begins. Assign user stories to developers. Add development tasks. And track open issues. In iRise, you can manage just about anything. And if you're already using other ALM tools, like Jira, Microsoft TFS, or Rally, our built-in connectors will keep all this information synchronized in real time. Create a requirement in iRise, and your developer will see it in Jira, including all the details like status updates and comments. Any changes he makes, including his replies, will be synced in iRise and vice versa. And a link is automatically created in your Jira requirements, linking back to a screen in the prototype that demonstrates its functionality. So now you won't just read the requirement, you can experience it. And if you're using a testing tool like Microsoft TFS or HP ALM, you can see the details, changes, and updates reflected there as well. A tester can create a comment on a user story, and you'll see it and can reply in iris. It's an incredibly powerful addition to tools like Jira and TFS. It adds the power of prototyping, provides traceability, and it ensures that every tool in your SDLC is synced and on the same page. Finally, let's look at some of the deliverables you can generate. When documentation is needed, you can create your requirements documents, functional specs, and design docs in one click. All of the information in your prototypes, every screen, UI element, and requirement can be exported instantly into documents you can customize to meet your specific needs. And that's it. iRise combines text requirements and user stories, diagrams and interactive prototyping, all in one secure platform. And the end result is you define the right requirements and deliver the right product. Many of the biggest and best companies of the world are using iRise and achieving amazing results. Start your free iRise trial now, or schedule a personalized demo. We'd be happy to show you how iRise can fit into your unique process.